Happening tomorrow, hundreds of students from Ohio and Indiana, they'll put their dance moves and voices to the test. Twin Lakes High School is hosting its 10th annual show choir invitational. As News 18's Cody Malin reports, it's more than just an on-stage performance. It's a spectacle prevalent in the Midwest. I've been waiting for this moment. Show choir. It's a sport of sorts made up of dedicated students sacrificing free time for the thrill of the stage. We're, we're practicing two, three days a week after school till 5.30 or 6. And then our students, most of them go to the musical after that, 6 to 9. As Victoria Saylor, director of vocal music at Twin Lakes High School explains, it's their hard work both on and off the stage making this weekend a possibility. What I love is that high school students can do so much. They take charge of things like making schedules and distributing information and they, it's just real world experience for them. The hard work of hosting such an event pays for expenses to put on the invitational. The rest goes right back into the program. We have choir fees um, and we are able to keep them as low as possible and that is solely because of this invitational. For students like senior Addie Korn, Soundwave is more than a choir, it's a place of community. You'll find your connections, you'll find your people, you'll find a place where you can be just you whenever you want to be. Twin Lakes Soundwave is one of many show choirs in the Hoosier State. And Lafayette, Jeff's own team, is headed to White County to compete as well. It will be just a great um, community feel, I think, here at the Invitational. We hope everybody from Lafayette can come out and support Lafayette, Jeff. And we are so excited to support our friends there because um, we're super proud of them and happy to, to get to learn from each other. And if you're still on the fence about checking out the show, senior Joseph Quillen says it's a day filled with unique performances. It's a great experience. Not every show is the same. There are different experience, different numbers of people, different members. In Monticello, Cody Malin, News 18. Now Saturday's event marks the first invitation Twin Lakes has been able to hold since back in 2020. This weekend's competition will be the qualification site for the ISSMA Show Choir State Final in March. For event information including times and also those ticket prices, just click on this story on our website at WLFI.com.